TV cameras were on hand as the beautiful people of Boca Raton came out to play at the premiere of the 400 Club at the historic Addison Restaurant. All right, y'all, it's your boy DJ Irie in the middle of Boca, lovely Boca, right here at the Addison. It is the premiere, the launch of the 400 Club. We call it Forbidden Fruit. Oh my gosh, there's a whole lot of forbidden fruit going around the Addison tonight. It's extremely, extremely beautiful. The ladies are incredible. Let me tell you something right now. You're about to witness the most voluptuous fashion show ever. That's why we call it Forbidden Fruit. Of course, we have Joanna Krupa. We're at the Addison, where they're launching the 400 Club on a Wednesday night to get more hip, cool, stylish people here with through the Gap Group. So actually, the owner of the Addison, Harold Katz, invited me to be a special guest. Tonight is about getting young people to understand the Addison. Look at me. Look how young I am. Yeah, but he's the superstar. Yeah. He's, he, he's the main guy here. The Addison is actually a historic mansion. I think this goes back to 1937. It used to be the home of Addison Meisner, the architect who was responsible for building most of Boca Raton. It was his office and his home. And about 15 years ago, it was turned into a very exclusive fine dining restaurant, which is known to be one of the most romantic restaurants in the area, and it is a historical landmark. I bought this place only because of, of the ambience. It kind of looks like a castle, doesn't it? The Addison, 400. It's actually going to be an exclusive members only club that we're starting here at the Addison every Wednesday and also on the weekends. Um, the term 400 actually originated in the 1800s by a guy by the name of Ward McAllister who coined the phrase to um, denote the highest members of society, the wealthiest, most prestigious members of New York society. What we've done is kind of revive the, revive the concept here of the 400 at the Addison in Boca Raton. There are big sponsors tonight. We're pleased to have them on board. Kettle One is sponsoring this event and they have a big ice luge here and you can have all kinds of martinis. You can have a Cosmopolitan, an Apple Teeny, Lemon Drop, or a straight up Kettle or Kettle One Citron. East Coast Jewelers is our exclusive diamond sponsor for the evening. They are providing millions of dollars worth of jewels for our runway models and Joanna Krupa. Joanna Krupa, from what I hear. Yeah, she'll be wearing some of our pieces tonight uh, along with a few other models I heard. A $300,000 necklace or some kind of jewelry for lingerie. I'm going to be introducing you to the owner very shortly, uh, Bobby, and he is a major um, celebrity jeweler. We're a family-owned business. We've been down in South Florida for 20 years. It was our 20-year anniversary last year. We cater to all kinds of clientele. We specialize in very hard to get high-end timepieces, very collectible, super rare watches, and as well as super high-end diamond pieces and rare collectible diamonds. Glittering jewels that will amaze. This is a watch made by Corum. There was 25 pieces made in the world, and uh, actually this was given to me as a gift by the family who was very good, close friends of mine. It's called a Corum Classic Skeleton. It's got about 65 carats of diamonds. It sells for about 450000 Really just delight. <laughs> They've got a fashion show going on tonight uh, with some tremendous people. You have to wait to see the fashion show. Fashion show. Fashion models tonight. A little um, fashion show, lingerie. The finale of the show is going to be supermodel Joanna Krupa modeling a $300,000 diamond encrusted lingerie set courtesy of East Coast Jewelers.
why you're watching A3 TV. Go to joannacupa.com and lifevideo.com slash joannacupa.